What's up everybody, it's time to check out Double Dragon 4. This actually just came out, and I have to give a shout out to uh, Arc System Works. They gave me a nice key to check this game out and play it. Oh, no, 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 no easy, easy. Uh, Arc System Works gave me a key to check out, so we're going to play this today. Uh, the one rule apparently that they have is you cannot stream straight through or play straight through the game. So this will be probably cut a little, cut a little more cut up than usual, uh, but we'll see how it goes. Uh, first of all, most important question, do you go blue or red, Jimmy or Billy? Jimmy or Bimmy, depending on your uh, translation here. I don't know if we can be watching that, we'll skip through that real quick. Get in the game here. Uh, the one thing that you can't notice on what you're watching, but what I see, uh, this game is running in a tiny window on my computer right now, and it does not seem to be a way to uh, enlarge it. Uh, we'll get some basic double dragons here. Double dragoning, some would say. Uh, playing with the controller, of course, you have the punches, you have your kicks, Jumps, jump spins, uh, flying drop kicks, like so. Got some Mad Max looking motherfuckers in here. Drop the rock. Drop the rock, now you're dead. Uh, there seems to be some like super moves in this game that I've yet to figure out how to do all of them. Like, this is from Double Dragon 3, I feel like. I think I played most of these ones growing up. So I feel like I have a pretty, a pretty decent idea. What all the things are. You got the uh, back elbow. Uh, a lot of these moves were different. There it is. That's like the uh, the room clear. Uh, most old school beat em ups like this always had like the oh shit, everyone's everyone's coming to kick my fucking ass. I gotta, gotta clean up a little bit here. Uh, one thing I noticed is I don't know how I do it, but there's some combination that I do that makes me do this uh, tiger knee here. And if you keep jamming on the uh, kick button, he will not stop. He will not stop until you get punched in your mouth. Uh, I beat a boss like that. I tested this out a little bit earlier, just to make sure it was working. Uh, but if you're playing the Double Dragons, uh, maybe not so much the arcade one, because those were those graphics were a little, a little slicker looking than most. But this looks exactly like any of the old Nintendo Double Dragon games, which is kind of impressive. Has a nice throwback kind of vibe to it. Uh, but here's what I'm talking about. You sit over here. Uh, you can kind of hear the whoosh once in a while. I mean, I'm drilling the guys in their stupid face. Got the most dangerous of boats here. Will we fall off the raft? I do not know. That's the same deal. Uh, we'll get kicked in the face a little bit here. If we get the knees going. All right, they, they're too smart for me. Uh, there's some sort of super uppercut you can do as well, but same deal. Like, there's a, there's instructions in the beginning of the game. In the one menu where it says, like, these are how you do super moves. Uh, but there's a lot of uh, key commands that I cannot remember. So I'm not always the best with uh, immediate memorization of things, to be honest. Sometimes I just make some mistakes, and I'm like, well, I don't know what this... I probably shouldn't know how to do the uh, super combos, but I just don't know how to. This is how I beat him before, so you can beat him like this again. Sure did. Alright, so we will uh, just get past the story there. We'll check out one more level. Uh, it looks very much the same. Maybe we'll check out two more, depending on how quick I get through this one. Oh, that, 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 that's the uh, the seahorse maneuver. That's a uh, legendary. Back in, 90, back in 92, uh, if you could do the seahorse, all the women would fawn over you. Uh, I believe there was many babies made that year due to that maneuver. Uh, but on the other side of that, if you were a woman and you did the seahorse, uh, I don't even want to... I don't want to be too vulgar, but men would just, you know what, just looking at you. It would just be all over the place. It would be like a flood just from so much nonsense. Uh, we got some platforms here. Uh, these old school kind of games are very... Awesome. See, some, here we go. Ready? Some bullshit's about to happen. Get ready for it. Someone's falling off one of these things. I'm not going to be happy. At least we can uh, super drive them. Super knee. But it's very... The jumps are analog. And by that I mean, like, you jump, and all you can do is do the seahorse. Or alternatively, if you jump to a direction, you're not, you're not coming out of the uh, jump animation. Unless someone punches you. For moments like that, back where there was a uh, ramp... I would assume some bad stuff can happen. Well, not a ramp, uh, holes. 
Like, like so. I mean, I didn't, I, I did not jump. So that technically was not the jump's fault. But that's the kind of shit I'm talking about. That's old school Nintendo right there. Where you can't, like, I almost died right there because you can't press up and grab the ladder. Like, you could can in most other games now. And, you know, as technology got better, you could do more things like grab ladders. Uh, I'm not going to necessarily say that those kind of complaints are the game's fault. Because it definitely seems like they, they definitely want this to be, like, Double Dragon throwback. Which is fine. I just feel like maybe missing some little like half steps here, half measures, due to uh, what they were going for, the concept that they were going for. It's a Bobo. A Bobo is everybody's favorite uh, muscly brute. There was a uh, Double Dragon two, I think had fight mode. Maybe it was Double Dragon one. One of the Double Dragon games had a uh, like a, a brawler mode, which is just one on one in Thunderdome. And Bobo was clutch for that because he just does he does these giant punches where it just destroys your face immediately. Oh, he's playing the drums in my head. Bump, 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 bump. Get that. Get down here. I know they're. I know in this game they're going for the. I mean, this is obviously retro as shit. There is no other explanation of why a lot of why this game looks like it does. Uh, why it controls like it does, uh, like Mega Man 8 and 9, when they would kind of put in the, the, the screen flickers and um, other sorts of weird graphical things like that because it's a throwback to a Mega Man game. Uh, same concept. Uh, they wanted this to be Double Dragon continuation so hard and so heavy that it's like 19. It's enough. Ooh, look at that! Tiger Driver, something headbutt. I don't know. It's not Tiger Driver, that's the, that's the rising knee I was doing before. It's just, it seems old. It come, it, it's brand new and it seems very old. Uh, and also, along with that, I mean, if you want to play old Double Dragon, you could probably hook up an emulator and play one of the old ones and have just as much fun as this. I'll probably uh, play through a little bit more, try to at least beat it once. Then there's a bunch of achievements in this game that I did not look at, but I can't foresee myself trying to get all the achievements in this game. Uh, I'm used to playing... I'm spoiled. I'm 33 and I'm spoiled. I'm used to fast games now. I can't be playing this old stuff where you, like, stagger around the... Blah, 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 blah. You know what I mean. Yeah, Double Dragon 4. Uh, thanks again to Arc System Works for uh, giving me a copy of the game. I hope everyone enjoyed checking this out. I know it was kind of a short video for the other kind of stuff I do on here. But, you yeah. know... Maybe you'll see it and be like, hey, I could use an old NES nostalgia throwback right now. Or could be like, hey, I've seen enough of this game. I don't need to play it now. Thanks, Tobes, for saving me some cash. And either way, thank you for watching. Uh, you're welcome if I helped you out. And I'll see everyone later for a different video. Lates.